Okay, we are back to work a little bit more on Asher's fishing game. Still don't have a title yet, right? Yep. Yep, but we'll get one eventually. Um, so Asher has informed me of a few things that he for sure would like different about this. So the first thing I want to do is deal with the fact that I'm probably not really going to use this main as main. Um, so let's just create a new scene. It's going to be a 2D scene. Here we go. I'm going to call it uh, main place. Right? Yeah. Okay. And that's where we're going to be putting all of the different images and everything like that. In that we also wanted to have, let's save this first. Save scene. We'll call it main place. And then we're also going to have a scene going to be a 2D scene, and that's going to be called the pond. Is that correct? Um, it was called pond one, but just say pond, because pond one was weird, because um, there's only one pond, that's where oh, okay. it started. Well, then we'll call it pond. Yeah. Okay, and that's Place another one. Place two, when we, I create it, it's going to be a beach, not a pond. Ah, okay, so place two is going to be a beach. All right, and then but we also no want... Beach. Too, because that's for Whoops. Like a long time. What was the last one you wanted to make? Um. What did you just Oh, workbench, right? Yeah, workbench. So when you click on that workbench we made last time, it's supposed to take us to a different place, and that'll look pretty cool. Okay, so that, that's just kind of some general uh, framework. Oops, I never saved that one. And I believe we wanted to work. No. Oh. I guess I can't call it that exactly, can I? Because it's not an image. Workbench. How do we call it? Workbench location. Did I spell that correctly? I did. Um, scene, scene, scene. Uh, we wanted to work on the pond today, right? Yes. So let's look at the pond. pond. Now we have some animated... Um, oh, I have to download some stuff. Um, we are going to have some water that we can put on there. Let me see. Nope, I don't have a good way of doing this. This part. I will, however. Okay, so we wanted to add the pond water for sure. So let's add that asset. And I can put the salmon one. in there. Let's put place one in there. And then what is that? What are these things? Um, oh, those are extended walls for place one because the walls, look at ah, how small the walls cool. are. Cool, okay, great. Let's put those in there too then. Good thinking. Yeah, the wall, and that's where you sell the meat. You're going to want a lot of space to sell the meat. Okay. Otherwise, where are you going to sell the meat? Where are we going to sell the meat? All right, so let's fix up this pond, and we can do a lot of things with this later, but what I want to do is I want to have an animated sprite for tiling purposes. I'm sure people have better means of tiling things than what I have, but I have a way that I like to do it. And we are going to do this by making another new scene. This time we're going to go to other node, and we are going to just have an animated sprite 2D. Where am I? Animated. There's animated sprite 2D. And we already did one of these, but that was as part of something else. Since this is just going to be background, it doesn't need to interact with anything. Let's do this. So, uh, or the human and all the stuff. That's where the place one should be. Okay. But pond, it's an entire different area. So two horizontal, one vertical. Boom, boom. And we can see how it looks. There's our water. Okay. Um, so I can either tile this or I can make it a lot bigger. A lot bigger, I think, because yeah. it's the entire pond should be like, I think it should be like really, like almost the entire screen, all right? Okay. Do I have a viewport here? I do. Good. Um, it doesn't really exactly matter how I do this, but let's do it like about that. What do you think? We can always change it if we don't like it. So we'll call this pond water. save that scene so save uh, scene save scene save the pond water 
And yep. if we go back to the pond, now what I can do is I can put pond water onto the scene. So big. Yeah, it's not quite perfect, but there's a lot of things we can do. We can change the size of the viewport and other such stuff. Um, ooh, we want that to play though. I think I'll be able to do that with the script. One of my favorite things about doing these live is I start trying to do things that I'm not sure if it'll work or not. So let's try it. Bunk. Oops. Physics. Process delta. And we will do pond water. Dot play. Default. And I bet that'll work. I don't see any reason why it wouldn't, but I don't think I've ever tried doing it quite like this before, so we'll see. Um, so that was that, and we wanted to try and put a fish in here? Um, yeah. Okay, how about I do, well, we want to make a salmon also, right? Because you have the salmon? Yeah. Uh, that one looks a little bit different. How about we use the sunny, because we already have a sunny? Yeah, but I want it to be, like, um, kind of small, like, really, s um, um, like, is there a way to, like, change the direction it's facing? Uh, there is. I have to try and remember how to do that. Or, really, what I mean is, like, halfway to the, uh, to the other direction. I want you to, like, so that you only see the fin, because I want it to hard to be catch. Okay, so you can only see the fin. Hmm. Not totally sure how we're going to do that. Can we start by just having it totally visible and then we will yeah. change it as we progress of this game because yeah. we have a lot of stuff to do. So let's put a couple of sunnies in there. And the salmon. And all right, we have to make a salmon. I know I, you see this image here, but if I do that, it's just going to be an image with no collisions or anything else. So let's make yet another new scene. And we'll make that a character body. This will be our salmon, and our salmon needs collision shape, and it needs an animated sprite 2D, and call that salmon 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 Don't try and say that too many times fast. And we're going to make that uh, accessible. And our animation is going to be it's this one, right? Shaman. You made this animation a while ago, didn't you? Yeah, I knew this. <laughs> that's going to look interesting in the water, I think. Okay, so that's that. And... Collision shape needs to be a rectangle. And I'll just make it a little bit bigger. How do, they, how do the dots make a rectangle? Uh, if, just if you connect all the dots. People at home can't see what I'm doing with my finger, but if you connect all the dots with straight lines, it makes a rectangle. If I zoomed in a little more, you can probably see more exactly how it was working. Okay, so let's go back to our pond, and let's put a salmon in there. Let's put the salmon over here, and let's see here. We want from our main place... You know what? Let's just do it this way for now. I actually forget offhand how to just try and run this one thing. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to change our run to pond. That way when I try it, it'll play just this thing and I'll see what the pond looks like. <laughs> Oops, we forgot to set that thing to play. So the sunnies aren't going to do anything. This is what the pond water looks like, and that's what this guy looks like. The little salmon water around it kind of messes it up, uh -huh. but that's fine. Well, that's okay. Um, we got to go back to the salmon and attach a script. And the script 
script is going to make the salmon aim in play. Okay, let's save that. And now... There it is! <laughs> What's he doing to that water? Looks like he's drinking it, kind of. I guess. I don't know. So this is cool. And then we'll just um, start and putting some stuff to make the fish kind of swim around, right? Yeah. Okay. So before we do that, I kind of then need to refresh myself on how to make that happen. I don't want to bore everybody with me actively trying to figure this out. So next time we come back and do more, we'll have some code to make the fish swim around. And other things as well, of course. So, hopefully you enjoyed today's episode as well. Did you enjoy it, Asher? Yeah. Great. So long, everybody. Subscribe and like. <laughs> That's right. Do what he said. <laughs>